report. Now we're still getting information on this, uh, this attack uh, moment by moment. Now several people from the Chattanooga area were in Las Vegas over the weekend. Brittany Martin joins us now to tell us what one man saw. Brittany. Stephanie Josh, I spoke with a man from Fort Oglethorpe who was attending a conference at the Mandalay Bay where the gunman busted a window to shoot into the concert crowd below. He wasn't there last night but describes the atmosphere since then as somber. Brian Griffin didn't hear these gunshots last night as more than 500 people were shot while at a festival on the Vegas Strip. He was in a nearby hotel. He heard about the massacre a couple hours later. At 3 o'clock this morning, uh, local time, uh, I, you know, I got a phone call from my wife. You know, she was worried because, you know, she knew I was supposed to be at Mandalay Bay. And Griffin is attending an IT conference at the same hotel where the shooting took place. But it's been postponed since some of the hotel is still on lockdown. He's spoken with a couple of his friends staying there. Basically, just the ones telling me that they're on lockdown, that they're staying in their rooms, they can't get out. Griffin says most people aren't able to get around today. He stayed in his hotel, too, and heard stories of heroism on TV. Yeah. People who were, uh, you know, like, as people were running from the uh, from the event, you know, like you know, strangers in their cars were just pulling up, throwing doors open, saying, "Get the car." Griffin says the meeting was supposed to last until later this week. He's not sure yet when that conference will be.